One of Greyhound Racing's main headaches has always been the neck and neck finish. Before the war, experiments were well underway to assist the judge by a camera device. Seen in slow motion, it's an easy matter to see which dog gets its nose over the finishing line first. But at speed, the judge very often can do with mechanical eyes as a check to his own. A powerful light beam focuses along the line of the winning post to register each dog as it finishes the race. Designed to take a picture of everything that happens at the finishing line, a continuous strip camera revolves at approximately the same speed as the dogs pass the post. After that, things move in the camera department. Within a minute, a strip negative is developed and sent to the judge. If the finish should be very close, a positive print can be prepared within three minutes. At London's White City, the words photo finish will tell backers to hold their horses or their dogs till the camera names the winner. Forgery of totalizator tickets has also provided a tough problem at dog tracks. Some people have tried pulling a fast one over the tote with a bit of slick work with pencil and pen knife. Once it was simple, now the payout window has a comeback. Tickets have a background pattern like a banknote, and an ultraviolet ray machine shows up the design. The original letters show a pale green, alterations come out black, and forgery misfires. <laughs>